Are we live right now, boys? How's it going, everybody? We are here in the nation's capital of Ottawa. Uh, we're gonna do some IRL. We're, we're gonna go down to Parliament. We are going to go press some journos, probably. It's gonna be a good time. Oh, we got Chad guy, we got big guy. We got Pine Point Populist. Yo, Koki's in the chat. What's going on, everybody? Let's uh, just get walking here. Right off the bat, we have a roadblock by our truckers. Feds, we got the federalities out here. So we're about like four blocks from Parliament, so we're going to kind of go down some of these side streets first, and then we'll end up at Parliament where all the boomers are having a dance party or something. So it should be some pretty good content. Let's just look here, we got all the trucks. Let's get some hogs going, boys! Yeah, let's go! Let's go! Let's go! Yo, everybody in the chat, let's get some HHs in the chat for Hong Kong. Hong Kong! <laughs> Yo, we got Kyle Frank in the chat. What's going on, buddy? All the HHs rolling in. <laughs> I can go! I hope that the stream doesn't lag. I haven't IRL'd in so long. That the last time that I IRL'd was when I was running across the border to come back to Canada from the US. So it's, it's been a while. I hope that uh, the connection's all good and stuff. Yo, we got Northwest in chat. What's going on, buddy? What's going on, buddy? And uh, if anybody doesn't know who this is, this is Shane Marshall, the infamous Pebbles. The guy who allegedly threw pebbles at Prime Minister Justin Trudeau. I don't wish so. to make a statement. A, a real can of Furster out here. We got a real can of Furster. But it's probably going to snow in the U.S. water crossing as well. What's going on? How's it going in America? Give me uh, some intel. The, well, now the, the Americans, oh, you guys have started up your own convoys. All, all the Yankees down there. I was yeah. seeing some news articles on that. So, all our eyes are here. It's popping up everywhere. You know, Canadians started this, and we've locked down the capital. It's fully gridlocked. The streets are empty because truckers have blocked off all of the intersections. It's true. And now it's become a worldwide international movement. It's absolutely insane. We don't like the feds. The feds are gay. I was saying this yesterday, and I'll have an edit coming out soon, but it kind of feels like Gotham City, you know? It's like... I'm like Joker or Bane walking through the streets of an occupied city. Yo, we got the Fed. We have a Fed patrol down here. We got a Fed patrol. And you'll, you guys will see a lot more Fed patrols. There's a very high amount of cops in the city right now. The recent intelligence report suggests that there are Fed rallies on every block. Yes, pretty, pretty much. They, they've had to bring in cops from London, from Toronto, from Durham. I've been posting on my Telegram. And we've seen, you know, convoys of like 30 blacked out CSIS trucks rolling around Parliament. And this is like our FBI. Yeah, yeah. It's a pretty cool place to be right now. You guys can probably hear the honks in the distance too. Those are all the truckers that are parked in front of Parliament right now. Trying to run us over in the streets. Yet another cop trying. <laughs> He had another pig trying to run down Patriots in the streets. I think he was giving us a Hong Kong. What do you think? I don't know. I, think he I don't know about that. I've seen HHs in the chat. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> signaling to the CF boys. We got some fuel going. We got some bats. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. Fucking help I'll do it. <laughs> <laughs> what's, uh, what's the cost of gas right now? It's like a dollar fifty or something. They are predicting that we're going to have the highest gas prices ever in Canada tomorrow. So shit's happening in this country. And obviously I don't like high gas prices, but this is a good thing because we need to send a message to these fucking globalists, right? And quite evidently, we are sending the message right now. The city lockdown, gas prices going up. And it's all Justin Trudeau's fault. To be honest guys, Jan 6 was kind of gay. J6 was based. This might be a Step little bit up more your based. Game is what I'm saying. It uh, might America. be a little bit more based. I mean, the revolution was based, but approaching Parliament Hill now, so the honks will get louder and louder as we approach. Boys, yeah. So this truck, and and there are others like this. They've taken the wheels off of their vehicles so that the RCMP can't tow them. So this guy just has them tied up here. Yeah, yeah, just, just kind of show it. Let's go, yeah! And also, this is 
kind of turns into like our right wing jazz zone at night. Freedom. What's going on, buddy? Freedom. It, it's it's kind of turned into like a right wing jazz zone. Okay? So during the day, there's rallies and there's speeches and people, you know, come out here and protest. But then at night, everybody just goes crazy and it's like a right wing jazz. Freedom is essential, we love to see that. And they've been writing stuff on their trucks. You know, patriots will come up and write their own things. It's the atmosphere out here right now. Honk, honk. Yo, Dalton with the raid. 07's buddy. Thank you for the raid, Dalton. I appreciate it. Is that, uh, Let's go. Quad Belt. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah. The stream, right? yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. What's going on, bro? Oh, it's squad. We feed our freedom! We should uh, probably head up to Parliament, eh? Let's go check out Parliament. Oh, let's go! Hold the line. I, I'm seeing some of you guys say hold the line in chat. And that's exactly what these truckers have to do. You know, obviously, we had a major, major crowd on Saturday. Uh, the RCMP said that it was 2.3 million people that came out and protested the government on Saturday. And obviously, there's not 2.3 million people out tonight. But as long as these truckers keep the city gridlocked, that, that now there's that potential for people to keep coming back. And the next weekend, more people will, will you know, roll in and... This is like a long-term game that we're playing here, right? As long as these truckers stay here, and as long as the truckers literally 20 blocks down that way stay there, what is Trudeau going to do? What is he gonna do? We have to end the mandates, right? Maxi Bernier, let's go. With my buddy Max, let's go. Show to Max. Extinguished our national flame, so it's time to go sign of the times in our country. This is Parliament. This is Parliament Hill. This is where the evil globalists conduct their work. This main building is actually empty right now. People don't go in there. But over here in the West Block, that's where I'm pretty sure the House of Commons is still going on right now, right? So right now live, we have Canadian MPs in that building right there holding that emergency meeting about Russia and, and fucking Ukraine. Here in the streets, truckers have completely taken over all the Wellington. We got a no more lockdown sign, that's pretty big. Shout out to no more lockdown. Desk says, can we get a fuck these demons in chat? So true. Everybody say fuck these demons. Anybody know what this says? End of all public health measures. This is the future site of our right wing mass grave movement. This more so fills up like during the day. We're going to see Ben the Trucker Boys. Can we get a 07 Ben in the chat for Ben the Trucker? If the RCMP are referring to him as Bin Laden Ben. Bin Laden Ben, <laughs> let's go. How you going, man? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Nice to see you. Let's, let's go, go. yeah. We have Ben the Trucker out here. And right. uh, he's holding down the floor right in the front here. He has the stage on the back of his truck. He has a massive crane extended with the upside down Canadian flag, you know, signaling that our country is in distress. And uh, for, for, for our live here, just want to say a few things like why you're out here, you know, how long you're going to stay out here, stuff like that. Well, I'm here for the long haul. We're going to stay right here till uh, we have what we came here for, and that's our freedom. Absolutely. Uh, it, you know, I'm going to be staying here too. I'm uh, staying here for as long as possible. Man. Thank you. Because it's like these things have to end. The mandates need to end. Absolutely. And you guys, all you truckers, you guys are the front lines of that, you know? And we as long as you that. guys don't move, we're here to support you, you know, to bring you food, gas, whatever it is. And you gotta end these mandates. You gotta go. Heaven's coming. Oh, they in. want you to honk your horn, they Oh, 07 Ben, thank you. Tomorrow, I'll be back up here in the morning, so I'll see you guys later. Hey, it's really, very loud, but right up here in the Prime Minister's office.
Pebbles. People are saying they're, <laughs> they're posting black filled Wojaks and Pebbles. Guys, we gotta find Pebbles. Maybe this stream is gonna turn into a fine Pebbles stream. I don't know. Back to us. Come back to us, buddy. Cease has picked up Pebbles. Even though he's innocent, he's completely innocent. He didn't break any laws. They still picked him up because they're feds. Because they're the government. Because they hate us and they want to kill us. We got Wurzelroot in the chat. What's going on, buddy? We got Dalton in the chat. 07 for Dalton and Wurzelroot. Say fuck Cease in the chat right now. Pebbles. No. It's a, it's a man. It's a guy. Okay. The, the man that threw the pebbles at the Prime Minister. Oh, I did not hear about that. <laughs> There's something. I'm coming back. I gotta Sweet. leave tonight. And then... Yeah, yeah. Absolutely, buddy. It's very important. Shit's gotta know? change. Exactly. Thank you very good. much. I appreciate Thank you. it. And I'll God see you bless. next weekend. God bless. Yes, we'll God bless. It. We're saying users are gay. So true. Okay, we're going to find Pebble. Yo, we have uh, Napoleon in the chat. What's going on, buddy? And he says, 35 CPC MPs sign a letter for Aaron O'Toole's leadership review. I saw that just before I, I went live down here. Very interesting. Aaron O'Toole is completely dead in the water. There's going to be a CPC leadership change. And it's probably going to be Pierre Polyev, who isn't much better. But um, it's very interesting politics that are going on with this. Because the CPC, they're trying to latch on to this while simultaneously like disavowing it. It's retarded, it makes no sense. The only two politicians that have been consistently out here and walking amongst the people and fighting for freedom are Maxine Bernier and Randy Hillier. Those are the only two. All of these CPC MPs, they, they show up here for like 30 minutes and they take a photo op and then they go home. It's, it's absolutely ridiculous. So yeah, I, I definitely did see that. It's going to be a big shakeup for the CPC party, but you know, not not much is going to change for us. They're all swamp creatures still, right? Where's Pebble? Yes, the crime minister's office is right up here. You Trudeau, you bitch! He's hiding right now. He's hiding in his cottage across the fucking canal because he can't take it. He can't take all these patriots out here fighting for freedom. Let's go. We're just BTFO'd by this base French guy out here. Let's go. You know, all these people in the media, they're calling me feds. You know, they're saying that I'm some, like, neo-Nazi is going to drive a truck through Parliament or something. But everybody's can first out here. That's the thing. Everybody's already Canada first. We're all Groypers out here. And even, and even if they don't know it yet, they're still a Groyper at heart. And that's what matters, okay? okay everybody loves Canada first. Pebbles, I keep getting distracted. Yo, Vince James with the raid. 07, buddy. Shout out to Vince James. Love you, man. Thank you very much for the big raid. Yikes Department says, Tyler's a Canadian campus conservative patriot. So true. That's all I am. Go and he went back to home base. Go must go on. Let's just go back this way. Let's head around and then come back. Beardson shout out on Telegram. Thank you very much, buddy. Shout out to Beardson. Love you, man. Love you, man. Oh, yeah. So here's the official flash. The awesome I'm the Prime Minister, Justin Trudeau, okay? You have to bow down to Prime Minister Washington. I'm not your office. Where are you? Where are you, Justin? All of these businesses, they're
are shut down. Nobody is going into them. Nobody's working. Ottawa is absolutely occupied, including the swamp. Yo, pizza, pizza. Yeah. Let's go. We love pizza, pizza, don't we, folks? Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Now, will pizza, pizza sponsor Cozy.TV? That'd be kind of cool. Feds are everywhere, by the way. Every single street corner. Still no sign of Pebbles. Who knows what he is up to right now. And we got here and there was a very large police presence, but no sign of Antifa, which kind of sucks because, you know, it would have been pretty cool to see Antifa, honestly. But uh, th this main intersection has been like fully blocked off. If you look at the far side there, we have a long line of truckers that goes like all the way back across down there. And they're just parked there and the cops have them, you know, blocked off with their barricades and stuff like that. And you know, part of the strategy with this, figure out different ways to get these truckers that are stuck, unstuck and past the barricade so that they can move into more strategic positions, right? So that's something that a lot of people are working on right now. Should we walk down like a couple more blocks and circle back? So true Canadianism, hit that follow button. Bruh. We have the facial recognition software. Fuck you, Trudeau. Fuck you, buddy. The Kimster says, is it cold out there? It's very cold out here. It's like probably like negative five, but we're still cozy, yeah. I mean, my hands are pretty fucking frozen, but we are still cozy. I have the Canadian blood running through my veins so I can take it, you know? I'm losing my voice too. You know, some people out there that wanted me to go live like, like the past couple days, I've been very, very busy. We're, we are occupying the capital out here. So I've been like having like 15 hour days out here on the hill in Ottawa doing a bunch of different shit. So my voice is like going too. I just kind of noticed that. I'm kind of like Randy. <laughs> Tim Hortons for all of our Americans that are watching. Canadian staple. And for any Americans that haven't seen a Tim Hortons, th this is what it looks like, okay? It's very interesting, right? This is what a Canadian Tim Hortons is like. And they put the donuts in there. The best coffee ever. I mean, it's a little bit shittier since Burger King took it over, but it's still very Canadian, right? What's going on, boys? Yeah. Yeah. Take off the mask! Take off the mask! Respect your hands! We had a mask talk. Two of those guys were cool, but then the other one was a fag, you see. Napoleon with a politics update. So it's looking like here Paul the Ev is going to be making a play here to uh, become leader of the CPC. But uh, don't fall, don't don't fall for it. You can't fall for Pierre Polyev, okay? I know that some of the boomers like him, but he's blackmailed, he's subversive, he is not our guy, okay? So don't fall for the Pierre Polyev trick here. But uh, it seems pretty inevitable that O'Toole is about to lose his spot as uh, the leader of the conservative party. No mandatory vaccinations, you'll love to see that. Let's go. Then we get a honk, honk, and a rebel. A very cool flag, regardless. Let's go. 
That's what we're fighting for here, folks. Yo, we got Tenryo in chat. What's going on, buddy? Nice to see Tenryo in the chat. Okay, should we head back to Parliament, then kind of cut around, and then we can go back? They're trying to get me onto the Tim Hortons Wi-Fi. Feds are trying to hack my phone. At night, like, the city is just completely shut down. And it's just a bunch of patriots that just roam around, like, yelling at each other. And, you know, like, partying and shit. We got some nice Canadian flags out there on trucks. It, it's honestly like a Trump rally. Like, it feels like Ottawa has turned into one big Trump rally. You know? It's all these big trucks that have come from, like, Alberta and rural Ontario. And they're flying Trump flags, too. We've seen a whole bunch of Trump flags. And they're flying upside-down Canadian flags. I've seen a bunch of red ensign flags, too. Yo, we got Vince James in the chat. 07 Vince. How's it going, buddy? Nice to see Vince in the chat. I'll see you at AFPAC. I'll see you at AFPAC 3, buddy. Got some more truckers here. True North Strong. Love to see that. DMV says get truckers on Cozy. That actually might be kind of interesting for tomorrow. Just, just get like a trucker to go live on my account. And just like give him my phone and just let him live stream as a trucker. A day in the life of a trucker. It's very cool to see like all these truckers writing stuff on the sides of their trucks. It's awesome. You love to see it. We got this scan this. That's me. Thanks for standing for our freedoms. Let's go. On this street leading away from parliament for like 20 blocks, there's trucks. Freedom, buddy. What's going on? We are live right now. Do you have anything to say to the Canadian people? Well, Canadian people, they, they poked the wrong bear, and we're here. Absolutely, they <laughs> definitely did poke the wrong bear. Yeah, you know, we're, we're here, we're going to make it, and we're here to stay. Yeah. And we're not going. We we're got, not leaving. No, we got the support of the people, and, and, and I've never seen so many happy faces. I've never been more proud to be a Canadian. Absolutely. And, uh, I the exact same I, I, I love my people. I love my country. I love guns, gods, and puppy dogs. <laughs> I'm from Quebec. I have a base frog out here. The base Frenchie. We yeah, are the French there guys. you go, man. Yeah, man. The but, French uh, Anglo Alliance is coming together right now. I brought my my 1500. Nice. I oh. want to come up with my coming. Yeah, yeah. Before the thing broke down, she broke down on her wig. Oh. Yo, we have Yoba in the chat. 07 to Yoba. It started off as a Canadian movement. You know what? It's a worldwide movement. The Americans get down had, to DC. I've been sad to be a Canadian for a while, but I can tell you when this convoy started, man, welcome back, Canada. Absolutely. It's time we to train are amazing. Us. We are true beautiful north, people. True north, strong and free. Let's let's, let's get go. let's get this done. Absolutely, man. Absolutely. Well, thank you very thank much. You. Hey, stay strong out here, oh, man. Hey, We're fighting for freedom. I'm staying here. Absolutely. On the truck, freezing my arse off. It's all matter. worth it though. Doesn't matter. I've had people give me food. I've had people. I had an old lady I helped me cross the street. She gave me 50 bucks. Oh. And it's, it's, it's a beautiful thing to hear. And yet we're fringe. Come on. Yeah, yeah. A, a small hey, fringe minority, hey, by the way. We're terrorists. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> hey, the cops won't let us fuel. They're trying their hardest to uh, break this they, up, they but they're they not going to. They fight, won't do it. You know that I had a buddy. I got buddies coming from Quebec. They just tried to pick up one of my buddies, giving a few. You can, like, arrest him? Yeah. Really? Right. Like, I mean, no offense, but this is the gay district. Get oh, shit. Let's get out of here, boys. We got to leave. What the? Bring it on. Well, I guess uh, base truckers have taken over the gay district of Ottawa. <laughs> Everybody's saying Parliament. They want us to go to Parliament. Oh, yeah. I'm also getting very cold. This is Canada after all. Good gloves? Bruh. Thank you very much. Very cozy gloves. Very cozy gloves. We are going glove mode. Yeah, he's also a pedophile and a terrorist too. <laughs> he's everything that is evil in this world. That's what he is. The main thing this weekend is that he is a terrorist. Terrorist is inside of parliament right now. 
And it's our job to get him out of there. We're not leaving until he's out. right here with us, buddy. I'm going to be staying out here in Ottawa until they end the mandates. Like, I'm staying here with the truckers, okay? Look at that. Fuck your mom, Trudeau. So true. <laughs> truckers are our heroes. So true. Okay, so we're almost back to Parliament now. We'll take one more stroll through Parliament. Kappa Mikey Groifer says stroll through Parliament. We're not going into the Parliament buildings, okay? I'm having the time of my life. This is a peaceful protest, and we're here to work within the confines of the system for a resolution. Absolutely. Yeah. And we're not leaving, are we? We're not, we're not we're leaving. Not leaving. Let's go. We're not leaving until we get our success. Yes. Yeah. Until we obtain our victory, we are not leaving. So Summer, true. Summer's just around the corner. It's gonna be warm anytime. We're staying. Yeah. Exactly, yeah. <laughs> I'll go for a dip in the river before I go home. Yeah, yeah perfect. Fun. There we go. Thank you very much, guys. You're Appreciate welcome. You, man. Nice see you. Let's go. We're gonna say Canadian Vince James. Y'all <laughs> Canadian Vince James, by the way. The Leaf Vince James in his truck. The MPs? I would Otherwise think so. Known as the House of Crimes. Yeah, the House of Crimes, the HOC. And um, I'm pretty sure that there's actually a bunch of MPs in there right now. Including Aaron O'Toole. Including Aaron O'Toole. Can we get a fuck Aaron O'Toole in the chat, please? That's a very underrated part of this whole pandemic. All the fucking ads that they shove in your face. It's some bullshit. I hate it. Can't stand it. We have we located Pebbles! Pebbles is back at the home base. We're good, okay. Let's go, boys! Yeah! Let's go! They're all saying base, sir. We got our base Serbian. So, so right here, there was a small counter-demonstration of Antifa. There was literally like five of them, and we just yelled at them. Let's go, we're getting some coffee, boys. There you go. Okay. There you go. Yeah. Beautiful. You got cream and sugar right here and warm pack for your... Uh, no. For, I'll know. take one of these if you don't mind. No, I don't yeah. mind at all. Thank you very much, man. You want a coffee? I'll take one. Fuck, you need Let's a coffee. Go. You look like you need a coffee. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> we could all use a cup of joe. Bruh. They banned me from the grocery stores because I'm unvaccinated. I got grocery yeah. grocery. Yeah. Hey, you pure guys want tuna sandwich? Uh -huh. We're the pure bloods. Pure bloods <laughs> if you guys want tuna sandwich in the green bag, got tuna sandwich. You got to that. Snacks and stuff. Come on down, coffee. It's free. Very much. We're all saying LFG base. Yeah, man. Th there's so many people out here that are just delivering free food to all the truckers that are, you know, giving people gas giving them everything that they need. And, you know, Justin Trudeau has the audacity to go on national television today and, you know, call us terrorists and, you know, say that we're all racist and white supremacists and all this shit. It's like, all these truckers out here, they've lost their jobs, right? They have children to feed. They have families to go home to eventually. And Justin Trudeau and Aaron O'Toole and all these globalists have completely fucked them over. So they're going to be pissed. And it's the Canadian people that are coming together to stand up for the truckers, for everybody who is unvaccinated and has been fired, right? The people are coming together here. And it's truly a beautiful sight. And all these swamp creatures that are up in this building right here right now, quite honestly, fuck them. Fuck them all. There's not a single good one in these buildings right now.
You guys are saying I'm spilling my coffee. Stop the spill. So there's, <laughs> they're saying stop the spill. Stop the spill. Well, you know, I'm walking, okay? So my coffee's gonna spill a little bit. It is what it is. Stop the spill. Stop the spill. Spills everywhere. <laughs> we drive the economy. That was pretty sad. So, so is Napoleon saying that this leadership review is coming from the conversion therapy bill? Is that what is that what you're saying there, Napoleon? Yeah, yeah, okay, yeah. So, so this leadership review is coming from the conversion ban, the conversion therapy ban. Nothing to do with oh, the truckers. In, no, no, back in fucking November. Oh, yeah, that, yeah. That's where it's coming from, which is very interesting. Look at this. We got some cops up there. We got some feds, some federal agents. Protect those who speak about the jobs. They speak French. That's not warriors. That's, that's all you need. You've got to speak French, and then you get a nice, cushy government job. We do have some more stuff to accomplish. We have some more work that we have to do. We are out here fighting on the front lines. But 07 to all of you guys who have come out here to, you know, run through the streets of Ottawa with us. It was a lot of fun. Then follow me on Telegram, t.me slash Tyler L. Russell on Gab at Tyler L. Russell. I've been posting a whole bunch of stuff on there about what's been going on here in Ottawa, in our nation's capital, and on Instagram as well, at Tyler L. Russell. Thank you guys in the chat. Can we get uh, a nice little 07 truckers, a little HH in the chat for our truckers? Yo! Montrudeau! Montrudeau! Yeah! Let's go! Fuck Trudeau! That's what I'm saying. Fuck Trudeau! Yeah, where is he? That's my fucking nose! Come suck my dick! Yeah! Yeah! Let's go, boys. And with that, we're signing off.